All right, I think I found my campsite. I am out here in the woods. Now I'm just setting up my car. I'm gonna put the fabric up top, block out the front view, getting my area set up with all the lights. Right now I got the Lucy lights set up, and then I'll show you around the front. Okay, if you're just tuning in to my channel, uh, basically this is gonna be like a little travel channel of me going around the country in this car. Right now I'm, I'm inside my car, and this is just my little sleeping area. This is pretty much my little office right here, I would say. Yeah, let me bring a let me bring a light back over here. Yep, not too big. Anyways, I am currently in Moses Creek right now. Figure out how to hold this. Ooh. I'm in Moses Creek right now, about a mile away from my apartment. I wanted to do a video of me sleeping in the car tonight. I this will be my second time. I've already slept in here once, but I sh and I shot a whole bunch of footage for that for that night. But anyways, it came out terrible. It, it was all dark. Uh, and also, I fixed my microphone, so that should be that should be a lot less noisy. I was hearing some clinking around, so that should be good. So tonight, what I'll do is I'll I'll sleep in I'll sleep in it for the second time, test it out, let you guys know how it is, and then tomorrow I'll show you the box, the finished product of a box. If you haven't seen that video, it's called the cargo box on my YouTube channel, and go and I'll I'll walk you through that. And also, I'll get some uh, drone shots in the morning. Right now, it is two, or as, I'm sorry, I was looking at the date. Two, two, two is the date, and it is Saturday at 9:58 p.m. And hopefully, I'll get to go to sleep here in a second. I'm gonna lay in bed. All right, I made it into bed. Let me fix that. Got to fix my fan real quick. This is pretty dang cozy and my Lucy light has a hole in it so this is one from eBay you should probably not get them from eBay at all that's probably why it has a hole in it anyways this is like really cozy it's tight but it is I, I could do it so I have foam foam here from Hobby Lobby. That was about like 40 bucks. This is from Amazon. It's like a folding mattress. That was about like 70 bucks. And then this is from Walmart. That's about uh, $25. If you're going to be sleeping in a car, hopefully your bed is top notch. There we go. I'll take my eBay light. Probably look like a creeper in here. Yeah, I'm in the middle of the woods, <laughs> sleeping in my car. Anyways, um, oh yeah, I didn't. I don't think I've shown you the um, paracord system. So what I got is paracord attached to basically the whole roof line. I mean, it goes it, it goes down here, but it's basically the whole roof line I mean or, or around my car all around my car so I can hang stuff up there right now I got the I got the fabric hanging up or so I can have privacy I got my charge pack here so I could charge my phone normally I'm gonna what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna make like a, a table or or put something here so I can put my phone and things over here I think this will be my like little nightstand and what else? I got my keys hung up by a little hook. Got my cooler set up. A little Arctic. I got a pretty good deal on that. It was only like 109, I think, for that one. I don't think it's a bad deal. Anyways, um. That's pretty much all I can show you from from this angle. Yeah, that's pretty much all I can show you back here. Anyways, I'm going to try to go to sleep, and I will see you tomorrow morning.
What's up, guys? I just woke up. Pretty sick spot. All right. Next time. I'm gonna park my car, I'm gonna make sure it's leveled. Like right now, I don't think it's leveled. Because that's what kind of kept me up, is it, I was like leaning out of my bed. But other than that, it was fine. I was pretty warm in there. Without those covers, I would not be. It's pretty cold out right now. The first sheets I had were terrible. I'll show you a video of that. Those things were terrible. Okay, I found out why my bed sheets are so itchy. I'm probably gonna have to get some new ones. So, I don't know if you can see this very good, but it's got these shiny pieces of, like, thin confetti, it looks like. But that is so annoying at night. I'm going to wash these and see, but I highly doubt all that's going to, like, look at that. Like, that's sticking out right there. It's so annoying. Yeah, I'm going to need some new sheets. I threw those away and I got some new sheets. And... I got had to get another pad, how to get another pad in there, make it a little bit more comfortable. Cause like I said, I want my bed to be as comfortable as I can get it. Cause I'll be spending a lot of time in there. And this is the box. I'll show you the box. All right, I got the flex seal. Now I'm just gonna grind this off. <laughs> Paint the inside. And let it dry some more. Yeah, I'm letting this dry out. Or this is what it looks like on the car. Alright, plenty of storage. Plenty of extra storage. And like I said, if you didn't see the other video, it's called the cargo box look at that but yeah like it's all flex seals so it's all uh, weatherproof or it was raining a few days ago so it was raining a few days ago and there's no water at all in there oh, maybe a little bit there's only there's just a little bit of water in here just a little drips that's it I think it might be from the condensation of up on the top maybe I can get maybe I can get like a little um, drip shield or something like that. Not a big deal. I'm gonna go out to the main and see if I can find like a landing pad for the drone. Or I might just drive the car over here. Let me see what I can find. Looks pretty cool. This is like the somewhat of the main road and I want it to be off and kind of hidden. And I think I did a pretty good job. A little stealth camping. I wasn't sure if there was any park rangers coming in. I don't want to get kicked out of here. So, all right, let me see if I can take that drone off. Great. Here, I only have five percent on my controller. I can't fly my drone. So let's get out of here. in my neighborhood so as I was coming down that hill I ripped this bolt right out of the wood Crazy. I'm gonna get some coffee 
and then charge up my batteries and then I should be able to show you where it was located. <laughs> Thank you again for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.